hi guys welcome to my youtube channel today i'm out uh, filming another food vlog it's been such an interesting day because it's been raining heavily extremely and now the sun is out it's bright but the roads are so flooded so there's so much confusion going on so much traffic but I decided I still need to go and do this. So today I'm in a cafe called Jody's by Eminence. And when I was having a look at the cafe online, I went onto their Instagram page and realized that this is actually a sister cafe of the one in New Farm called Jody's. And unfortunately, the one in New Farm has been flooded out because of the rains. And they were just like, oh, please come and support the one here in Fortitude Valley, you know, just to show love for small businesses because, yeah, it's crazy so much is going on so many businesses houses have been flooded out and you know the people have to move out start all over it's so sad but yeah we still have to see the positive in such situations i was looking at their menu and realized that they've got a brunch and lunch menu and also you know like a separate drinks menu apart from having a lunch and brunch menu they do have salads that they sell i think it's a it's a daily thing so you can order that off the menu like when you go to the counter choose a salad that you want to have instead of ordering from the menu so yeah for the first time i've taken something that's off the menu always good to try out different things that's why it's good to come to cafes because not only do you get to see the dishes you see on the menu when you're looking at things online but you can also there's so much more to see so they have specials they might have like salads and other things that they're selling that are not on the menu and it's always good to experience that because sometimes they're seasonal don't mind me sitting here looking at the food drooling but i'm like this is my world how long can i come yes thank you thank you it's really nice and warm salad i've tried a bit of it and it's so good and refreshing especially considering when you go to this restaurant sometimes there's so many fast food kind like fatty and healthy foods on offer so it's just good to have something healthy and refreshing they had two different salads on display so and they said that you can actually mix the two salads instead of just having one the two salads that i mixed were the pumpkin and beetroot salad and the other one was the pesto and tomato pasta salad portion size is so big just thinking mm. it's, 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 it's quite good and uh, the salad was the salad is nine dollars and that includes you mixing both salads and then on top of that the chicken uh, was how much was the chicken the chicken was five dollars extra and that's fourteen dollars which is pretty good a bit tough to cut but that doesn't mean it's bad it's just you know a bit hard to cut on your plate that's a bit slippery oh my god this toasted almond croissant is amazing it's so good and so fresh 
in the fact that they just said it, it came it was a bit hot when it came but now I've taken my time and there's air from the building so it's a bit cool but it's still really really good and refreshing so the toasted almond croissant is six dollars which is you know not too bad um yes it is six dollars for a croissant i think it's a bit on the higher side but i guess because it's been served in a cafe it was toasted and had almonds that's probably why they are charging that much for it and of course i want to try the, the drink this is a beetroot and apple juice so refreshing as well it has mostly the taste of beetroot that's what you feel strongly i don't really feel the apple that much but it's it's sweet sweet and nice and then uh, the drink is meant to come with a mint leaf but uh, because of the flooding they can't get all their supplies so she kind of put some edible flowers for me in the drink so i'm really happy and impressed with my food packing fortitude valley is always very tricky when it comes to parking it's very difficult to find parking and if you find any parking it's paid parking so it was such a relief to come and uh, get free parking only because Brisbane City Council is having an offer in February of free parking but on any other normal day you either expect to come and pay for parking and also despite the fact that you're paying for parking it's a bit difficult to find. I've also realized that this is a place where the people who work in the offices around I think they pop in here to have coffees, lunch and all that. I came when it was pretty close to lunch time so there are lots of people who look like you know they are having their lunch break from the office popping in to just have a quick meal and probably that's why they have the salads available where they can just grab a quick meal rather than waiting for a whole dish to be cooked. They are open till 3 p.m. which is you know a bit more other places close up too. The pricing of the place was quite reasonable. I mixed two salads and the total price for that was nine dollars and on top of that I added grilled chicken as a side and that was an additional five dollars and my drink which was called the blood bun which is a beetroot and apple juice was six dollars and then I also had the croissant which was six dollars so in total I spent about twenty six dollars which was quite good because the average price of when you go to places is between thirty and thirty five dollars so twenty six dollars is not is is okay so the location it's in fortitude valley and it's quite most of the cafes and restaurants here are a bit on the higher side so it was good to come to a place where i only spent that much money apart from that the cafe is so nice looking it's so pretty it's set in an indoor kind of area so when you enter at first you think they're office buildings then you enter the main building and then the cafe is right there at like the lob lobby of the, of the building it's so nice so aesthetic the green like it, the thing is mostly gray and green and you know it's so beautiful so they've got this section where there's like a, a tall glass window you know it's perfect if you want to get like some nice photos and all that and they've also got uh, the inner section which is it's slightly dark it's not as well lit but it's nice we've got like a wide section where you can sit a couple of people that's all i had for jody's by the eminence uh, thank you so much guys for joining me today please don't forget to like comment share and subscribe if you want to check out any of my other videos from before i'll link some of them below and I'll also, at the end of the video, you'll be able to see one that you can check out. And let me know what you guys think down in the comment section. See you next time.